what's up guys and welcome back to another video right onto my youtube channel today i'm gonna basically tell you how to fix this issue if your raft is crashing on straight up so stick to the end guys this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you will probably know what to do in order to fix this issue before we start right into the video i just want to you guys know let you guys know that i would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like a comment or a subscription right onto my youtube channel it would really make my day and help me out as a little youtuber as i am Especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys. You will support my work on YouTube a little bit and I'm gonna really be thankful for that So I would just say let's get right started So as the first step I want you to basically open up your task manager by clicking onto the taskbar and right clicking it and opening up your task manager What I want you to do next is gonna be simple to navigate to the top left corner of your screen clicking onto processes and afterwards I want you to simply click one of those processes and afterwards just type in R in order to find Roft. If nothing pops up, it's good for you. If something pops up, I want you to simply right click and end the task. Once you're finished, you should be able to end the task manager again. As the next step, I want you to take your Steam shortcut on your desktop. And if you don't have it on your desktop, I want you to navigate to the bottom left corner of your screen, clicking onto the Windows symbol and simply using the Windows search function in order to find Steam. So once you found it, I want you to simply drag it right onto your desktop. So let's quickly come back. You have it on your desktop, right click, go to the very bottom where it says properties, Steam properties pop up, compatibility and simply copy my settings. So let's quickly run through it. Compatibility mode, enable, run this program in compatibility mode four, select Windows 8, disable the disable full screen optimizations as well as enable run this program as an administrator. Click apply and OK. What I want you to do next is simply to uh, right click it and click on run as an administrator and afterwards your Steam will pop up and you should be able to launch your game over the Steam launcher. Yeah guys, that's it for the video. I hope I could actually help you out with this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. I'm going to really be thankful for that. I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you guys, but I'm just trying to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.